Hi everyone, I'm Mr. Milestone and I'm at the Women's Euro 2022 final to speak to the people and find out what about this England team inspires them. So stay tuned. Hi, so what's your name? Evie. And Steve. Nice to meet you both. And what inspires you about this team today? Everything, just the way they play. It's just so good to watch. Well, you've always played football, haven't you? Yeah. So um, yeah. that's what sort of got her into it, really. Hi, so what's your name? I'm Anushka. Lovely to meet you. Love the name. What inspires you about this team today? Well, um, I found my own football team and I, and I really like football. Wow, amazing. I love your football team. So how's that going? Is it going well for you? It's going very well. Amazing. And what, what's the score going to be today? I don't know, but I think, some, I think someone's going to win 2-1. Yeah. England, right? England. Come on, Lioness. What inspires me is like I didn't have the opportunities when I was a teenager to go on and play football. And I wish I had it today, but I don't. But it does inspire me to get into try and get into kicking the ball about again. But Sophie, they inspire me to like get as far as I can with football, and it's like amazing that they're here today. The next so. England player, by the way. Yeah. All right. Come on. Yeah, come on, England. Remember the name. Remember the name. Uh, yeah. Layton. <laughs> Sophie Layton. I just think that they they work really hard. Um, they're really great role models for um, young footballers as these two are. And um, yeah, I think they can go all the way. They're amazing. Yeah, come on, Lionesses. Lovely yeah. stuff. How about you both? Um, I think it just shows like how far women's football has come and that what even more it can do for so many people here. And it just inspires me to do it for the future. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. And, and you? Yeah, I just really, I want to play for England when I'm older. So to come and see the final is just really inspiring. Yeah, we're an excellent team, aren't they? Done so, so well in all the uh, performances, all the, each game and everything, improved each game. Uh, and I think hopefully they're going to win the game. Yeah, come on, Lionesses. Come on, England. The only thing you can do it is the ladies. <laughs> Hi, so what's your name? Uh, Okiki. <laughs> Okiki, nice. And what inspires you about this team today? Well, I mean, the, the fact that they have, against all odds, now come to the finals uh, for the first time since 2009. That's really amazing, isn't it? Uh, same as Kerry when I was younger. I had more opportunities, a little bit more, yes. but um, just all the hard work the Lionesses have put in is just absolutely amazing, yeah. yeah. Would you echo that? Yeah, definitely, yeah. We used to play football and just like, I think they need the recognition that the men get as yeah. well. Just changing the narrative of football, man. Making sure that the football is not a man's sport. I've seen a couple of games that women, they're, they're cold, man. The touch, oh my days. Yes. Some of my boys haven't seen it yet. I keep, sometimes when I'm watching the games, I call, I call my boys, I'm like, listen, listen, the touch, the flair, it's too much. The pride, the passion, the energy, motivation, desire. They just do not stop the Lionesses. They do not stop. I think just how far they've come, like, so suddenly and, like, just how great they are as a team working together as well, yeah. yeah. Today, it's a possibility. It's not just today. It's what happens next for the for the women's game. In my case, for Izzy, what, what, what happens for her football and career now? You know, who knows, but it gives people hope. Uh, how well they've done bringing the nation together. Uh, how, you know, how good they've been in all the games and yeah. you know, hopefully bringing it on today. Yeah, fingers crossed, couldn't agree more. Anything to add to that? Their courage and just passion for the game, it's just so inspiring to young people like me. It's absolutely amazing. Well, I've always played football um, when I was younger and we went to, I went to games with my mum when I was younger and it was, no one really cared about it, no one really went. And then today, just look, like, look around, it's so busy. Hello! Everyone's loving it, everyone's excited. Uh, yeah. It's coming home. No, just how they've got like everyone so excited and they've broken records for how many people have come to watch the games and things. It's amazing. So my cousin plays for the England under 21s. So it's nice to see these girls that she could maybe be there one day. Yes, love that. Well, having watched uh, the girls play in the semi-final and the quarter-final, they're just brilliant. Uh, and we're hoping for more today.